Okay, this video is about the um, front load uh, washer pump attached to an electric DC motor that's rated at 36 to 12 volt DC and I have a lamp socket on it. Right now that's an LED lamp. So to fire it up without any load on it we get on the multimeter we get about 122 volts AC when it's plugged in we get a lot of light and 113 volts AC so probably enough to light two LED lamps The fluorescent lamp, or CFL, it uh, only acquires so many milliamps here, 19 watts, and it takes 350 milliamps. AC and lighting the lamp very bright. Now this is a 40 watt globe lamp with a incandescent filament, tungsten. That's not bad. When I hooked up a bridge rectifier to it, this guy, I hooked it up to the AC line going out to the where the socket is, and I could not even light this 12 volt auto lamp from a car. It wouldn't do it, but uh, I believe this thing will crank out about a half a watt. I mean, a half of an amp. So it's a pretty little emergency lighting system for anything AC if you want. And uh, it comes in handy. You can get any motor like this off of those vacuum cleaner portable ones or a hair dryer. You got to look for these or you you have to pay about 35 bucks if you bought it brand new for the front uh, loading washer pump. But I got it out of an old machine and that my brother gave me. And he gave it to me, so I made it. I had to check it out. I had to see what it did. Uh, I didn't try looping it to itself because I don't believe, I think this thing would draw more amps than this is about to put out. So it's not even worth it. So that's about that. And this is my latest project for April 7th, 2018.